What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. I'm Gleeter, and we're playing some Red Dead Redemption 2. And this is a mission. We're in the original camp. The first, not the original, but the first camp we set up. And this is a mission with Hosea. So let me show you the map here. So, yeah, just the very beginning of the game. And we're right here with Hosea Matthews. Looks like we're going hunting. Jose, you want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now. Unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you can buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. Okay, so we're gonna focus on our horse. This is gonna be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. <clears throat> Ride this big boy. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. Man, he's a big, big old horse. Easy, big feller. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. There, boy. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah. Uh... Just about. Huh. That turned it. In... I've got a waypoint set in my camp, so I'm gonna turn this off. I do have a bounty on my head for five bucks. So if I run into any Whoa, trouble, I gotta okay. take care of that. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day, and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> Bill and Phil. Yeah, maybe you're right. Lenny and Jenny. Let's feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. So the original train we that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. We robbed. We got some bonds off of it. Yeah, that's it, boy. Easy, easy boy. Good morning. Yeah, okay, boy. <laughs> Stables are just up ahead. Take right. the horse into the Go stable. Sell that big brute. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. 
Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <whistles> yeah. And yeah, what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But, your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. Okay, so we can sell or stable the horse. Five dollars and twenty cents is all I get. Man. Um Okay. Well, let's let's go ahead and sell this bad boy. Buy a new horse. So Morgan, my wife actually used to have a Morgan. It's a female. Fifteen bucks. Man, I got the money. I got 287 bucks. We must have buy a good horse. The Dutch warm blood. Warm blood. Nice. Okay, let's do the American Stead, bro. Let's spend some cash. Get a good horse. You're going to be new, my new buddy. Oh. And her name. Uh... Let's call him Sar. Am I spelling it right? Um, no. Mister. What should we call him? Pickles. Worth. <laughs> Meet my friend, the horse, Mr. Picklesworth. All right. <clears throat> Attack. Okay, we got saddles. We got 137 bucks left. Holy canoodle. Look at all this. I guess... I spent a long time. $65. So what is it? I don't, I don't see if it... Alright. So saddle bags. Okay. Change the color of the stirrups. So we have so these actually affect your speed and acceleration, which is cool. Okay, so plus twenty five. Already own these, looks like. Plus ten. Plus twenty five. Let's buy that. Okay, so we got the hooded stirrup. It's kind of, kind of goofy looking. It's the best. Okay, we got different horns we can pick from. Oh, that's pretty fancy. I'm not necessarily in the mood to spend money just for aesthetics right now. I want. That's the blanket underneath. I don't really care about that. We got bed rolls. <laughs> you can customize this quite a bit. This is pretty slick. Okay, grooming. 
Okay, let's see. It's main. It's natural right now. Regular. Short. Long. Braided. A mohawk. That's slick. <laughs> Sweet. Or dreads. Interesting. <laughs> let's go with... Let's go with regular. Okay, what color do we want? Does it always go to one side like that? I guess so. Kind of like that. A little different. Oh, man. That's pretty boring, right? That's cool. Whoa. I said it wouldn't go for aesthetics, but... <laughs> I changed my mind. Oh, the tail. Long tail, braided tail, dreadlocks. What's up with the dreadlocks? That's hilarious. Regular tail. Okay, what services? Horse care package. Rename horse. Horse care package. Fully restores all horse cores and yields gold cores. And this is only five bucks. Why not? Okay, provisions. We can buy some carrot, celery, hay, peppermint. Sugar cube, horse stimulant, horse medicine. Just gonna spend a little bit of cash here. Got a reviver. All right, that's probably good. I don't want to spend too much money. All right, partner. Which I already have. Yourself a deal. Spend a lot of money on a horse. Find a new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. <laughs> Talking to himself. Here are your papers, and on me, a new grooming brush. Oh, thank you, sir. Some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Mr. Peppersworth? Oh, uh, Picklesworth. Mr. Picklesworth? Not bad, Arthur. You happy? I guess we'll see. Whoa! All right, buddy. We're Hop gonna be... Up there. Let's go. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Yeah, I like this horse. He's a good-looking horse. It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's a code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. Uh, I never would.
So this <clears throat> will be interesting. So we're going back in the mountains. I wonder if there's a bunch of snow. I don't have any winter gear. Well, maybe I do have... I may have an outfit with a coat, because you can change outfits depending okay. on the temperature. I think we need to head right up here. Looks like we're good. Yes, I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. Man, this... The, the scenes right here are just gorgeous. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Follow Jose. Jose. <clears throat> Let's ask about Sean. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains to see about Sean. Bounty hunters who've got him? So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use any... too powerful on a small animal like that just ruin the meat best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle i have hunted rabbits before you know yes and obliterated them with a shotgun if i remember right <laughs> okay now we're hunting rabbits so let's move up a little bit see on the bottom left of the map See a little yellow dot there. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna hop off the horse. We can be quiet here. Hunt a rabbit. Be very oh, there's one right there. Okay, let's stow this rabbit away. All right, back to Jose. Idiot. They say Jose, so I don't know exactly how you say his name. All right. I guess it's Jose. Getting late. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Well then, we get us set up. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, switch to items. <clears throat> and we can do a camp. Very cool. Well, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. Craft and cook. All right, so effects. All right, let's cook it. Press X to cook. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. We have anything else to cook? Yeah, we do. Cook it, cook it. See? Right off the fire. Demon blow on it. <laughs> All right. 
Well, we better get some rest. Time to turn in. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. Hey, we're gonna sleep the morning. He better be worth all this drama. The clouds roll over, and the night turns to day. <clears throat> Morning, Arthur. Morning. You ready? Oh, well, give me a minute. Oh, coffee. coffee. Sure. There you go. <sighs> Hope he brushes his teeth. So. What's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting a good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. Tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was... Okay, so potent predator bait. So we've got gritty fish and blackberry. So, so the effects. Attracts pristine predators in the vicinity. The weaned on bear meat. Okay. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Come on, grab your stuff. Okay, tear down the camp. <clears throat> okay, let's go. All right, Mr. Picklesworth. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, good. I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen. If Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks. Dung, bones, any sign of him. Okay. <clears throat> you have entered a legendary animal territory. Follow clues. Track the animal. You can find legendary animals throughout the world. Okay, what do we have over here? Let's inspect. Some paw marks here, Hosea. They sure look big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. Uh, should we like get a gun out? I should get a gun off my horse. Um, horse cargo, let's see. I have a shotgun. 
double bear. There we go. I feel a little more comfortable now. Okay, we found the tracks. The tracks go into those. Investigate up here. Ah, fish. Wait a minute. Inspect this. There's something on the ground here. Little Not fishy. Eating fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. This music's pretty intense. I like it. We walk really slow when you're an e this eagle. Eagle eyes, what they're calling Someone it? Else on the ground, just here. Just like There's Assassin's Creed. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. Got the bear poop. Okay. He wants us to. I wonder if there's a cave or something that's gonna be in. Here, Mr. Bear. Damn it. Looks like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Let's use the bait. Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Here's a large stone. Okay. I assume this one. There's a lot of large stones. Oh, there's the yellow marker. Or, not really a marker, but just. Okay. Open the satchel. And here's our bait. Now we wait. Go to the rocks. A thousand pounds, you say? More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? Huh? Yep. Good. You okay? You seem nervous. <laughs> so do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. <laughs> oh, this is not good. Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Oh, Jose. What are you doing, man? Give me a hand here. Got your knife? Shit. Yeah, we did it right. What's up, bear? Now it's too close. Holy canoodle. Holy cow. Okay. That 
That was fun. <laughs> wow. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's nothing. Nothing at all. Thank you. I think. That was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming, or you gonna track that monster? Well, you coming? Let's stay. I'm going to stick around here for a while. <laughs> I'll see you back at camp. Yeah. All right. Mission's complete. So I don't know if you can go and, uh, Oh, where's that? Oh, a plant. Wow. Let's see if we can't track this big boy down. We could use its pelt, be nice. There's his poo. Must be near. Here, Mr. Bear. Paddington. Lenny. Come here, big guy. I hear him. There he is. Oh! Oh, he's tearing me into pieces. Oh my goodness! Holy cow. Oh, man. Look at the claw marks on my back. Man. <laughs> so we got some canned strawberries we took. Let's see what else do we have. We have an apple. All right. Let's skin this bad boy. That's not gruesome at all, is it? Oh! Right up the lake. <laughs> well, that's how you skin a bear, I guess. Wow. I call my horse. Come here, dude. Come here. Come here. <laughs> okay, let's stow the fur. And I don't know if there's anything we can do with all this meat. I don't think so. I think you just automatically, it showed like the fat and everything that you take. Mister, I had spelled Picklesworth. Picklesworth. <laughs> That's hilarious. 
All right, so I'm gonna head back to camp. Get myself cleaned up. Huh? Looks like I need a bath. And I don't know where my hat went. Man, I got a big old wound in my face too. That's great. All right, thanks for watching. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.